Welcome back to the Surf with Joe Show with Chef Frankie. We get the DJI Osmo Action back again. We're going to see how you work Osmo Action. But Labor Day, Labor Day came and gone. Yes, it was Memorial Day. Thank you for everyone who gave your life for our country. But the big sale was the small barbecue. Now, you always see everyone cooking on a big barbecue. Maybe you don't have room for a big barbecue. Maybe you don't want a big barbecue. Or, for whatever, for tailgating, for little places, this is the one. We're going to unbox it and assemble it, if possible. It says, available in 30 minutes or less to assemble it. We'll get, don't quote us on that one. But we're going to see if they give us tools. It does not mention they give us tools. It's pretty much self-explanatory. Let's see, we got here the grill grades. And we got the manual. Handle is all out. Little parts. Oh, you know how we love little parts. And there goes the phone. It just has to listen into everything. This is the top. And down there. They don't give you no tools with this one. No tools. Bottom. You see what is what. This will be on the bottom. Should be on the bottom, but it doesn't look like they're going to make it that way. So we're going to need to get up to the instructions. You know, it's like the top. It doesn't tell you what is what. Now, usually this stuff is so easy and the instructions are so bad. We're going to take a look. All right. Everybody look. And try and figure this out. It doesn't tell you what you use. So, that wants to start on the top. All right. See? That goes on the top now. That's just, okay. Okay. Usually, these go on the bottom for the vent. But, eight. So, what do you want us to do here? Get these legs down in there. Put those down in there. Part A, which will be this one. Okay. You know, like I said, they just don't have this stuff go right. And what parts are we using for it? D, E, and F. N, A, and C. Okay. You know, this is just something else. This is something. You can't get it open. <laughs> yeah. Well, if we don't record all of this... That's all right. We're just letting you know we got a small barbecue. After we get it together, we'll let you see it. And we want to try out the new Osmo Action that came back. See how that's going. Okay. I'm going to set these up here. Because I don't want them going everywhere. Sorry, I don't understand. Yeah. Don't like that watch. So it says A. This one's an A. This one's an A. Okay. Oh. Okay. Gotta unscrew this thing. A wing nut. They make them tinier and tinier. If you got jumbo fingers, good luck. Let me try and pick this up. Like I said, good luck. 
the little hole here. That goes down in there. And the little wing nut goes on top. And don't worry about tightening them all tight until after you get it completed. See? This is why it takes two people or you pay them to assemble it. This came from Walmart. Don't trust them at all assembling anything. You know, this used to be easier when the parts were bigger. There we go. There we go. Let's just see that. How's that work? There we go. Like I said, this is for like tailgating. If you're gonna have like a small apartment, Chef Frankie down here really enjoying the handle. Squeeze this together and it's in there. Now let's see what part they might want us to be. I'm gonna have to guess on this one. This is just like wing nuts. There's no regular bolts. So we'll go with the wing nuts. I can get them out of there. Tiny, tiny, tiny. That on there. Pick this up. At least with this one, you hope you got a handle to hold on to. Now, these are like small part. This grill is like for a small party. You'll be able to cook a lot with it, but a little bit at a time. A little at a time. Didn't say it was a great grill for permanency, but that's not bad. We get that part together. Put that down here. Like I said, there's not much, there's not a screw up here, so this handle, you're not gonna tighten it too much. I mean, it is what it is. No, we don't want it. Hey, you know what? We got a screwdriver right here. We're gonna tighten this up. I was gonna wait to tighten everything together. Screwdriver, gonna fit in there, folks. It. Man, there. I got a bunch of tools back here. How does that work? Not bad. Not bad. Now, when we light our grills, this is on the bottom. That's why I say it should be on the bottom because we do our paper towel through there and light it make it easy but okay now we're going for the other part duty men's or less okay no that phone is something else the watch whoa <laughs> okay <laughs> let me get this part a little trick from Chef Frankie in the Surfer Joe show. If you don't want these constantly coming off, super glue them. That's your best part is to super glue these. Oh, it cracked. Well, you can take that up. That's for the dirt anyways. All right. Let's see. And what, what parts are you going to need here? You're seeing B, F, and G. Which one's which? No. Is B and F. Okay. Little washers. <laughs> yeah. Little tiny washers. Put those back there. Now. Let's just do here. These are the legs. Have the washer like so. Put that through there. 
and these twist on, supposedly. And we're going to tighten this up right now with the screwdriver, if I have to. Push my finger hard. Okay, that's good. Um, I got one of these screws. Number B. F. If you have a child with you, a little person, it's good to have them help you. Because they will remember this stuff. And it makes it easier with their small hands with these small parts. And we'll take the one. Oh, I see another one with these broken little legs. Well, this was 15 bucks at Walmart. So, like I said, for traveling, for camping, for a small place, for a tailgate. A lot of places won't let you bring a huge barbecue grill to tailgate. Remember that. There's that one, okay. So far. Okay. We'll be gluing that or taping it or not worrying about it. You know, cheap is cheap. Sadly, they make things nowadays that are too cheap in quality. Done. Through the hole, finger there, hold on to it, ah, use the middle finger, we're not going there about the middle finger, it's on here like so, oh, that did not sound good. We'll tighten them all up when we're done. Like I said, remember, it's from Walmart. So, it's not an expensive grill. So, you got to be careful with it. If it's a little wobbly or so, then it's a little wobbly or so. Remember what it's for. You know, have a good time. If you, have to, if you can use, use it without the legs, you can do that. Do that on there. I've seen some $200 grills. They're already put together in some of the stores. And they just wobble everywhere. Okay, now. We'll make the screwdriver. It's a standard Phillips head. And tighten up these legs. Not too tight. We don't want to break them. There's four of them. Go. All right, that is done. Put that over here. See how that looks. That uh, you say that looks good. It's a smaller grill. If you don't need a big giant grill. Get one of these. Now, I'm not saying they're going to be $15 still, where we got it out of Walmart, but still. It's not hard to put together. It's not going to be hard to use. You still have to season this as a normal other grill. I don't care if someone says soap it up. You don't want to use soap on this at all. You do not. You're not going to mound it up with a lot of coal. You're not. Okay, let's move on. We got those on, got the legs on. Now it wants us to put on these sliders. Sure, girl. Let's. I remember right, they go in here like so. supposed to slide but it doesn't want to do it no more so let me read so I said before you never really needed instructions but now you do let's see E and A 
That one was. Yeah, it shows it going in there. Yeah, shows it going in. Okay, sure. Except that. There. Yeah. Almost have to break the thing, which is not good. See, it went in, then there's a hole here. It will fit here so you can slide it back and forth. Move that over there. Yeah, Walmart. Okay. What screws are we using? It says A and C. And E. Okay. A, E, and C. These. Okay. The wing nut. The little washer. See what I mean? By how small these are compared to when you have a big hand. So if you got a little person with you, child, small, some with small hands, it's good. Now, let's see. You're going to want to put the wing, let me get this off, get it over here, so if it falls like it did, the wing nut on the outside. Sit this down there like so. Pick this up. So you gotta get this, see how it's notched? You wanna get it in here, like so. And then slide it here, line it up. Now the wing nut goes on the outside. So we got, you might be able to see it. There, hold it with this finger, comes back. Get you guys to be able to see this. Put it on here. Notice we're not cursing today. If you do it, if you do, make sure no little people are listening in. Let me tighten this up right now. Screwdriver, hold the wing nut. There we go. See how it goes. This will do your airflow. Now, when you're grilling, your charcoal's in here. You got these both wide open, they're gonna burn. But if you can master it, you can have one wide open, one not, and this side of what's open will get hotter than the other. If you can get that down, also the wing nut keeps coming loose. Okay. Wow. The old days, you wanted the wing nut on the outside. You know what? We're gonna, we're gonna loosen up. Come on. Oh, okay. We just it's just moving around. It's in place. We're gonna leave it. We're gonna do the other side. Gonna do the other side. Just leave it. I mean, that you might want the wing nut on the inside. This on the outside, but do it however you want. These instructions really don't show too well. Of how they want it. If they do, it's up to you, anyways. So, there we go. Do this. They don't tell you what tools you need. I got pliers over here, too. Because you never know. You just don't. See, holes over here. Again, two little notches. Going between here. So, lift it up. Like so. Gotta line it up. You know what? We're gonna put this ring nut on the inside. And we're gonna see. You can do it either way you want. But the quality of this thing, you might get to last forever. But man, trying to get this in there. There goes the wing nut. But you gotta remember, the wing nut in here and that charcoal, this whole thing's gonna be hot. So, if you try and redo any of this while it's hot, you're gonna get burned. Okay, let's see. This is the one with the wing nut inside. Does it move better? Little stiffer. That's up to you. See this one? 
wing nut outside, easier. And the wing nut's loose, so you're gonna have, constantly have to tighten it up. So, uh, you know what? Let's just reverse it. Because no matter what, we don't want, no, we're gonna leave it. Hell with that. Hell with that. Just gonna leave that. Down in there. And the grades. Okay. The grades. The little one goes in first, because that's going to hold your charcoal. See? That'll hold your charcoal. Now, if you put a couple pieces of wood, chunks of wood, or a rock to lift this up, you know, it might help you out. But, if you want to keep these clean aluminum foil down here, you don't need to have no rock or nothing. Because the rock now you put it up there like that, it's like that. The drippings go down in there and it's easier to clean. But if you just wrap it with aluminum foil, put that in there like that. When it's all done, take this out. You got everything, lift up the aluminum foil. Because you want the aluminum foil to come up this way. Now, you don't want aluminum foil to block these. That's how your air is coming in. But you can cut and everything. Pull it back. Those little tricks for you. Big grade. Goes on there like so. Grill top. Like so. Now, like I said, are you going to do a whole slab of ribs on there? Not at one time. Now, if you cut them, but ribs are big. A couple ribs at a time. If you're going to start doing big grill, party grill stuff, you want a bigger grill. But for this, this is good. A couple hot dogs, sausages. Hamburgers, a chicken. If you're gonna do whole chicken, split it. Boom, boom, boom. If you're gonna do some wings, the drums it. Boom, 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 boom. Like I said, do veggies on it. But like I said, it's a smaller grill. It's gonna take more time. But there it is. It's together. Bro, yeah, whatever. No. And amazing thing is, we still got parts left over. <laughs> So we got parts left over. So, you know, I don't know what to tell you. Anyways, that was a $15 grill from Walmart. It is the expert grill. Show you the paperwork. iPhone 13. Now you Osmo action. Hope you're recording this Osmo action. Because last time you did not do us any good. All right, there is the grill. We appreciate you tuning in. Done. Under half hour? Yeah, I guess. I'm not counting. Maybe we'll use this this week. Don't know. But anyways, there is our tailgate party grill. This stuff, I guess it, it's going to be wobbly. That's closed. Let me show you. Closed. So let some air come in. So, hey, like I said, it's a little pump grill. Looks pretty sturdy, pretty nice. Great. Now, we hope you enjoy. Chef Frankie says, hit that subscribe button. Please, we'll get more subscribers. We appreciate that. Like our videos. Share our videos in our channel. Also, we have an email address. If you want to email us anything, <coughs> Go to our page on YouTube where you're seeing this, hit about, scroll down, and there's a click there, link for email. You can email us. Boom. Give us your questions, suggestions, whatever you want. Also, since we have been having problems, this is Osmo Action by DJI, we got a big surprise coming very soon. And we thank you, thank you, thank you. Is this is how we got this big surprise that's coming up. Because everyone donated through our PayPal, to our buy a cup of coffee, a Pentatron, or whatever Chef Frankie has hooked up on our YouTube channel. Please, keep donating. We appreciate it. 
My hands are still a little oily from all this. This is why you do what they call seasoning or burn off. After you put this together, if you don't want the oil in that, wear some gloves. But that's why you do the burn off for this stuff. Because you put the coal in here, leave these open all the way. Like you do when you start your grow up. If you want, throw some wood in there. Some um, barbecue wood. Leave that grate open. Don't fill it up this high. You don't need it. Just put some in there. Let it burn. Let it get going. Put that on there. It's going to burn all the way down till it's done. And it will be seasoned inside. The outside will be too. That's going to get hot with all that heat. Burn off all your oil. Everything. Keep this covered up. Keep it in a small place. Keep this always clean inside. Always keep it clean. All right, we appreciate it. Thank you for tuning in to the Surf and Joe Show with Chef Frankie. If you're in the military, if you were in the military, or your family has, thank you for your service. We appreciate that. Again, it's Memorial Day. That was the other day. We appreciate it. We're so extending our thanks. We're trying to get Facebook and YouTube to upload our videos that we have made of the ceremony that we were attended to honor and remembrance for Memorial Day. All right, we got to go. We got more to do. Thank you for tuning in to the Surfer Joe Show. Chef Frankie, we're out of here. Cowabunga! Uh, we just got to manually shut everything off. Come on, Chef Frankie. Hit these buttons.